A live look now at the Perot Museum of Nature and Science. The newest downtown Dallas attraction opened its doors to the public today using Mobile 11 technology. Our Bud Gillette live at the museum. And Bud, I hear it's very visual and very hands-on. Absolutely, Shari. On a wow factor, this is a 10. We're in the T. Boone Pickens Life Then and Now Hall here at the Perot Museum. It shows animal life in Texas through the ages. There are some real fossils. If you look over here, for instance, that gray spine is an actual fossil of a dinosaur. Next to it, though, a cast replica of complete dinosaurs. These are compared with animals you might see in Texas today. The museum's mission is to inspire minds through nature and science. I like the planets and the dinosaur exhibits, really cool. Whether traveling through time and space or back in Earth's history, the Perot Museum of Nature and Science wants to teach. To be able to experience uh, science, engineering, math in a whole new way. No matter what they do in life, having a basic grounding of science is so important for children. I am really expecting to see how, how the how gravity works. Gravity defying is one way to describe the opening ceremonies. <laughs> the duo band loop did an aerial ballet down the side of the museum as dignitaries gathered below for the official ribbon cutting. Even the architecture, a large floating cube with an odd glass covered escalator on the side, is designed to spark curiosity. 50 million of the 185 million dollar museum was donated by the Perot family. What we have in front of us is 180,000 square feet of inspiration that will get everybody very excited about science. Patriarch Ross Perot and wife Margot assisted Mayor Mike Rawlings in the formal ribbon cutting. I would like for you to join me in the great British tradition of three cheers. Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip. Hooray! The city is counting on it attracting people of all ages again and again. You're wowed by the big things, but you'll have to come back and see the details and why it is and how it all hooks together. They're going to love it. They're going to have fun. And the minute you walk in that door, your IQ goes up 10 points just for being here. Back live, we can tell you that more than 6,000 people came to the museum today, not including the specimen you see there behind the glass. Uh, the museum is open until midnight tonight, but normally it closes at 5 p.m. daily. Live in Dallas, Bud Gillette, CBS 11 News. So